Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadgex, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to jailbreak your iOS 8.3 device. For this video, we'll be using the Tie G tool on your Windows computer. And with this tool, you'll not only be able to jailbreak 8.3, but you'll also be able to jailbreak 8.0 through 8.1.2, and also 8.1.3 through 8.3. All right, so the first step is you'll need to download the Tai G tool on your Windows computer. This is what the website looks like and you can download the latest version of it through here. If you have any of the older iOS versions, you can scroll down and you can download the ones for 8.2 beta 2 and 8.0 through 8.1.2 through the links here. But once you've downloaded the zip, you can unzip it to extract the file within it. And here is the executive rule file. So now I'm gonna double click. Just click on I understand the risk and run anyway. Uh, don't worry, nothing bad's gonna happen to your computer. And then this will appear. And now here, it'll tell you to turn off Find My iPhone once it recognizes your iPhone. It'll also tell you to take off your passcode or unlock your device if you have a passcode on your lock screen. So I'm gonna turn off Find My iPhone, and you can do that by scrolling down, going to iCloud, and going to Find My iPhone and turning it off. Okay, just tap on Turn Off and now it is off. So now we can go back to Tai G. If for some reason Tai G says that the Apple drivers aren't installed on your computer, you'll need to download an Apple driver file that you can find in the article. Because Tai G only requires that you have iTunes, but if for some reason it doesn't work, you can use this file and it'll fix everything. So now I'm gonna click on recheck, and here you can see my device shows up. Uh, you're gonna want to uncheck 3K Assistant. You don't need that on your device. And once you're ready to jailbreak, just click on start. Okay, now you can see that my device is jailbreaking. This should take no longer than a few minutes. Your device will restart, so don't worry about that. All right, and this is almost finished, so it's restarting the device. And the jailbreak has now succeeded, as you can see here. So I went through a lot of issues, and I got stuck at 20%. So what you'll need to do is you'll need to uninstall your current version of iTunes and install an older version. And you can find that link in the article. And you'll also need the iTunes driver, which I told you about earlier. You'll also need to install that. So with both of those, it was fine. Other than that, I had a, it was just stuck at 20% for a really long time and my phone just kept restarting. But luckily those two files will fix all of that. I also got rid of the passcode and put my device on airplane mode just to make sure for some people that worked when they got stuck at 20%, so I just did that anyways. But it might work when you connected to Wi-Fi, so I just put it to be safe. And so now you can see that my iPhone 6 with 8.3 is jailbroken. Here is Cydia, and I can open it up to find tweaks and all that. All right, well that's it, thanks guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Gadgetx. All right, thanks guys.